hello everyone today we are going to replicate the movement modes in our game so here as you can see when i resort character is going to uh, crouching mode or sneaky mode and you can see that change replicated across all the instances of the game similarly if i press shift character is going into sprinting mode that is also replicated and if i press caps lock character is walking like this that is also replicated so everything is replicated so i tested with the client and it's replicating from client to clients and client to server now here is the server the big one that is also properly replicating across all the instances so yeah this is what we are going to work on today and before we get started i'd like to remind you you can download the project files of this project and all other thousands of projects that i have done from the patron page link is in the description below and this is a part of this action rpg with gameplay ability system tutorial series i'm doing you can watch all the episodes in my channel i'll leave the link to the full tutorial series in the description and yeah let's get back to today's tutorial okay so right now if i play in multiplayer mode and if i crouch so here i am crouching in the in a client as you can see it's not replicating to the server similarly if i toggle working still in the server it's running but in client it's uh, so basically toggle working is also not working so basically anything that i have implemented with uh, set moment mod is not replicating here this because i haven't replicated this set moment mod event so that's what we are going to take care of today okay so um here let me put this everything collapse into one node and call it moment modes because the event graph is becoming larger and then in yeah, let a comment also right now let's get some space so here this set moment mode so we need to replicate this for that i'll add a custom event set moment mode server and i'll mark this as run on server okay as reliable too and then i'll do this instead of doing it here i'll do this part here like this let's call it current new moment mode and this is running on server now here i'll simply call set moment mode server connect this moment mode okay why is this uh, error? Set server. All right. Now I'll set this variable to rep notify and copy this part. And then double click here so we can go to this on rep current moment mode here I'll simply get the current moment mode and update this moment mode value on the op rep notify now that that actually should be all let's test okay now let's test with this client yeah as you can see moment mode is updated and it's replicated from client to clients and client to server now let's test with the server see 
that's also updated and speed is also properly modified in all the instances sprinting also seems to work yeah yeah okay so it's working now and what's this error get blackboard value as actor okay this uh, are there anything else no that's so And one more thing, uh, let me go back to one of one player mode. So someone mentioned in the comments that if I crouch and overall character goes inside the flow. So uh, anyway. To fix that, let me open the animation blueprint and here in the anim graph, I have this part which is, this is the part where I move down the character. Uh, I'll change the locations of this slot, default slot. and. Move it here. Now that issue should be fixed. All right, crouch. Yeah, now it works properly. Okay, all right, great. And thanks for watching. Updated project files will be available for the download in the Patreon page. Link would be in the description below. And next time, let's look into how to implement footstep sounds and how to make enemies react to footstep sounds. And when we crouch or sneak, we will prevent uh, having any footstep sounds. So yeah, let's look into that in the next episode. Goodbye.